bro. Sorry, you can't see me. There we go. Oh my fucking god, dude. It just gets better and better and better, dude. Seth. You know what? Seth fucking Rollins. That's what we're gonna call his ass, bro. Seth fucking Rollins. Just beat Logan Paul. And what I gotta say, listen, man, if I was Dave, right? You know, you you if you know who Dave is, you know who I'm talking about. Dave Meltzer. Right? That bastard. That's got to be at least four and a half. That's got to be at least four and a half. Oh my God, that was insane. Holy shit, bro. And so the Prime guy, right? So Logan Paul came out with this dude dressed up as a Prime bottle. And I'm sitting there like, hmm, who could that be? Right? Because you think, out of all the people, you know, they could have used or anything. This next match I'm not too excited for. But anyways... Fucking, you know, I'm just sitting there thinking, like, well, it's not Jake, because this dude doesn't look like he's got so much muscle, but then again, it could just be the fucking uh, stupid shit thing he is, but, not the stupid shit thing he is, but the, the prime bottle, right, but it was fucking KSI, and, holy shit, bro, that was just, an incredible fucking match. My ha Logan Paul, dude, you may have done some fucked up shit in your lifetime, but one thing you're good at is fucking wrestling, bro. Hell yeah, man. You may have took the L, bro, but as far as I'm concerned, that match, you both walked out with the W. Fucking... KSI got fucking splashed through the table by Logan Paul, you know, uh, Logan Paul hit fucking, uh, hit Rollins with the GTS, uh, paying homage to my boy CM Punk, you know, he's old, he's tired, and he works with fucking children, well, he worked with fucking children, I don't know, well, we shouldn't phrase it, phrase it like that, but he's old, he's fucking tired, and he works with, worked with children, and anyways, paying homage to that bastard. Uh, but they didn't announce, but they called it the GTS, you know, they called it to go to sleep. They didn't mention CM Punk. But I just gotta say, man, like, that was fucking fire, bro. Logan, keep it up, homie G. Keep it up. You got a fucking bright future ahead of you. Oh, that was an insane match, bro. I, I don't know what to do. Because it's not even over. That was like the second match. And this is only night one. No, this was the third match. I forgot the John Cena match was pretty lackluster. But let's not let's not talk about that. We already did. Holy shit, bro. Rollins, you're goaded. And Paul, you're one of the best motherfuckers. Well, I should say Logan, not call you just Paul. But you're one of the best motherfucking dudes to... You know, I mean, you're not one of the best dudes on planet Earth, but you are one of the best dudes on planet Earth at fucking professional wrestling. You do this shit better than uh, some of the motherfucking guys you see in the indies. Anyways, uh, so this next match is coming. Damage Control versus Becky Lynch and her gang. We're going to see how this one plays out. That was WrestleMania where... We're two for one. John Cena had a shitty match, but the other two matches amazed the shit out of me. And now it's time to see what Bayley's got in the bag. Anyways, peace, and I'll catch you in the next one.